Hello everyone, welcome back to Thinking Fast and Slow. For those who didn't see the previous video, I don't have much time to explain. 18 seconds until the beginning of the tournament. And uh, it seems like, Ten, in short, nine, eight, what I'm supposed to seven, do is six, to play bullet, five, but instead of four, having a regular mouse three, setting, two, I'm gonna put it on a very one, slow setting. Zero. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> it's not easy. Okay, let's get ready. Get ready. Make sure everything is working. All right. My objective is mainly to gain rating despite being so slow. I have to focus on short looking moves to avoid losing on time. Okay, I'll get already a piece up, but I'm gonna be very slow. So I better focus on precision. Come on. Ah, so difficult to make a move. I need my full concentration on every single move. Hmm, check. It's so hard to concentrate on the position also because I have to focus on moving the mouse properly. And it's so slow. Oh, another objective that I have is to also kind of commentate uh, on the moves every now and then. Not sure if I'll make it, but I want to try. Okay, am I losing some material? Probably, yeah. Go here. Pretend to be sophisticated. Oh, I have bishop c5 next, actually. No need to pretend. Okay. This is funky. Let's take it. And actually, I can go this way. Nice. We should be four. Life is good. Oh, playing slowly is very difficult. Queen h6. Let's go here. Oh no, it's running mate. Okay. Is there a proper way to defend? Oh no, this is not what I meant to play. Okay. Still hope. Still have some hope left, I think. But the time is difficult. Oh man, I'm missing all my pieces. Even though it doesn't take them. Oh man, the time. Okay. <laughs> We're off to a bad start. I thought it would be an easy win, but I have to be very precise. It's not a trivial win with a regular mouse setting is not the same here. So let's have a look that the stream is working and everything is fine. Hey, Tyler. Team Samsung, official shifted. Christopher Hansen. Yeah, baby. Let's see if I can... So my main, my two main objectives, other than surviving with this mouse setting, is to... I wanted to say not to be flagged in any game, but this is already too late after the first game. So as mentioned, two objectives. To gain rating at the end of the event, which already will be ex an extreme challenge. And to... What was it? Something with... Uh, something to do with... Uh, with chess, right? Okay, here my main hope is usually to flag, but with this mouse, it's not gonna be easy. Okay, so I said gain rating in the second one. And there was something there. Something to do. over yay tricked him he won't resign yay got another pawn 
Must be so good when you have all the phones. Okay. Second objective, something to do with playing um Ah, commentating. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so just developing regularly, putting my rooks, my knight to the typical g3 square in this structure, now developing the bish, the queen, next, feeling good, yeah, he has some weak pawn structure now, f5 is isolated, I'm also leading by development a bit. He's threatening f4, so I'm getting away from the fork. And now seems like he's very pinned. f4 opened up this diagonal, and now I'm gonna get this bishop from him also. Doesn't look like it's gonna be very fun for my opponent. So I'm just gonna grab the pawn. If he takes my queen, I'll take with the bishop. I'm just a pawn up and he still has this weak pawn here. So feeling good. More or less. Still need to be careful from the d file if he goes rook d8 and rook d2. So I'm gonna offer the exchange. And he accepts it. So this should be. I don't know if it's objectively winning or not. But from the bullet point of view, it should be a trivial win. My king is a little bit trapped and I don't want to move this pawn yet. It's not something I'm very eager to do. It feels like it's a compromise. So now I've got my king out finally. Now I'm gonna try to get some squares. Enter the position using some squares around here. Uh, it's not so easy. Ah, C4 was possibility. All right, now I'm getting in there, little by little, even though it's almost Zugzwang and I'm losing on time. Okay, let's focus. He could have taken, probably. should rush yeah silly tricks for the end I would have tried better if I had a normal mouse setting but I'm still not sure I'm gonna win okay this was difficult Whew. So difficult to make moves with this mouse setting. It's next to impossible. Okay, knight g6, the typical maneuver. And this is a compromise, giving up the bishops for no good reason. And um, now I'm gonna put pressure on this position, activating my pieces with every move. Doubling the rooks. Yes. Let's take it. I think I'm winning some material. Yes, tricked him. Okay, I was supposed to win a pawn, not a full piece, but I, I'll take it. Want to exchange rooks if he lets me. Oh, but taking a free knight is even better. Let's put a bish here. Look. Takes. Just gonna snatch everything. King on f8, just in case he wants to penetrate later. Okay. My bishop d3 check was there also. Okay, let's go. Moving along. Okay. Placing pieces on the board, exactly. 
Team Samsung. All right. So how are we doing here? Already 60 people have joined the party. 66. Not so bad for such a slow mouse. Uh, Win D5 makes some sense, I guess. Let's go for the throat. Ah, you gave me a piece. Thank you. And another one. How lovely. This brings me to a philosophical question. What's better in bullet? Slow mouse? I mean, what to have a fast mouse or a fast brain? I currently don't possess any of them. But at least I finish my development. Life is good. I have to prepare moves in advance, otherwise I won't. I will lose so much time on each movement. Okay, let's make a window for the king. Put my knight where he belongs. Okay, I don't want to be in the x-ray of the rook. I have a piece up, so it should be trivial as long as I follow some basic principles. Okay, but I'm, it's not so easy to make a normal move, so I'll just try to move pieces to the center all right uh -huh. oh, what's going on it's hard to follow <laughs> i feel like i'm winning or very close to it time okay got it Whew, this mouse is challenging <sighs> only minus nine points by rating not too bad winning the tournament is not one of my objectives by the way i'm putting too many challenges along the way that i don't really expect it to happen with the last the first round loss it was a bit painful it cost me quite uh, some time Okay. Neighbors talking on the phone in the hallway. I'm sure my microphone is picking it up even louder than it actually is. worse but to be honest i find it difficult to concentrate with the phone conversation in the background so i don't even know how to proceed let's go here need to defend oh no but he has the other okay i have to do it let's exchange at least oh didn't take on b2 life is shining again is good with the pieces being active when your pieces are active your life is really good especially when your neighbors are loud okay okay i'm gonna politely request uh, some silence just a moment.
Sorry about that. Let's join the tournament. Still talking, obviously. That's after they said they would be more quiet, so <laughs> or that they might not talk on the phone in the hall, but remember to appreciate what you have, not what the the small things that are missing. As long as I have Wi Fi, I don't get to complain. And probably a thousand other things that I could mention, but Wi-Fi seems so obvious. Uh huh. Okay, so my commentary at this point is that I'm an exchange app, and um, Okay, so life is good again. Okay, the reverse Grunfeld. Can't be a, a bad idea. Pawn up is also not a bad idea for me. <coughs> Just developing my pieces. Exchanging the rooks should be a good idea. But I'm not gonna force it because it's not going anywhere. Okay, now I will. Because I ran out of useful moves and uh, let's put a pawn on b3 different color than the bish actually I want to keep the bishops on the board I don't know why just feels right and to take the file that's farther away from the king so I can have more potential to dive in now bishop d4 king d1 if rook c7 getting rid of all of his square maybe a3 next try to have a, a passed pawn He just wants to give it away. Now this bishop is lost. <laughs> this kind of slight precise move uh, always makes me laugh. I don't know why. I'm just such a big fan of these silly trolling moves at the end, which are also objectively fine. I, I mean, I think it was objectively correct. piece like this is not something I thought would happen. Ah, I'm not winning a piece. Okay, never mind. Still have some initiative going. Hmm. Not a lot, but some.
but my chances of winning the tournament declined a bit since I wasted a bit of time. My Lich 6. Oh, this looks almost uh, dangerous for him. If not very dangerous. Okay, if he takes an e5, he's winning a piece. He takes here, still winning a piece. The fate. Is, the bishop is pinned because the fate is hanging. The knight moves have knight g6 mate. Not that it matters, just to figure that out. Mention it for no reason. Queen takes, queen takes. So, feeling good. Okay, this is a nice trick. And uh, c4. Take and c4. And bishop will take with check. Okay, let's take with the rook, whatever. Seems legit. Okay. Slow mouse setting. After this tournament will finish, I'll stop the stream and immediately start a new stream with a fast mouse, set mouse setting. Because I'm very amused by this entire concept. I don't know why. It's really funny when I, my mouse went so limited and my mouse just cannot move. For some reason I find it extremely amusing. Yeah, baby! Gotcha queen! Somehow I'm in the first place and I'm gaining 16 rating points. Yay! I love it when they do this g4, g5, and I <laughs> never understood why, other than the fact that there is a pin, that it might be cool. Okay, actually, I kind of tricked myself there. Let's go rook h7. Pretend I saw everything. <laughs> oh, so silly. Okay, rook h6 next. Oh no. Should flag. Flag mode. Okay. This looks good. Queen b7. Oh no. I need something against queen b7. Okay, gives me this guy. So suddenly I'm back in the game. Okay, let's put the king here, just to be safe for a moment. And I had rook h1 check. Okay, whatever. Knight f7, rook b8. Okay. Feeling good. Checks. Yeah, baby. I think I guaranteed the win in the tournament, and if I don't lose. Uh, then uh, any games, then I probably won't lose rating. So all I have left to do is to commentate like a boss. This is supposed to be theory, but I think I confused. I'm pretty sure I confused. I don't know. ED was the main move, not this. But this still looks kind of cool. Let's go here and here. Yay! Haha! <laughs> I'll take it! Because I'm the one with the limited mouse. So you get no excuse for, for mouse slips. Oh, on the next tournament with the fast uh, setting, I'm gonna make so many mouse slips and I'm not gonna ask for takebacks nor mercy. So worry not. People will get everything back from me. Most probably. Okay, 
Yes, most probably yes. Maybe I should also insert this setting into the games. So theoretical. Although I think it's good for white, I mean in this version. Now I'm threading E5 as far as I understand. Now not anymore. Okay, but for bullet I think it's a good idea to go G4 at some point. Maybe now. <laughs> I give the exchange and I won't take it. Because I'm that cool. I'm not even going to take it. Not sure what I will do instead, but I'm not taking the exchange. Okay, we'll sacrifice here for sure. That's what the dragon players always do, regardless of anything else. But, okay, I feel a bit, I feel like I should be winning somehow. D5, yeah. It's mate, <laughs> didn't even realize. Nice. Okay, 30 seconds until the end. I don't feel like playing another tournament, another game before the end. It's been too challenging with the slow setting. Okay, so now you see this is the slow setting. This is a bit faster. Sorry. This is a bit faster. This is the regular one that I'm using. And this is the one I'll use during the next stream. <laughs> it's insane. So I use the same movement on the pad and it does this, where in the other case, the one where I played it did this. So it's gonna be quite fun. Okay, so the next one starts in five minutes, actually in three minutes, so I'll stop the stream as quickly as I can. And hopefully life will still go on in a very pleasant way. <laughs>